your EMF is going off this time. Oh, mine's going off too. Oh my god. Got something? Oh my god. Oh my god. Dude, I captured three blue ghosts. It's okay. We, we need to leave. I, I don't I don't like this at all. I'm Mo Sarji. Oh, that's how we do it. I travel the world to seek out haunted and abandoned places to document the unknown for your entertainment needs. Go, go, go. Careful. From abandoned ghost towns to, hide right now. to being locked up in the basement of haunted mansions. Those ghosts, your spirits, would tell her, build this, build this. To fighting for my survival on deserted islands. And when I'm not pissing off demons in haunted mental asylums, I'm exploring underwater caves and using giant magnets to find treasures. Ah, we lost the no! Subscribe to my crazy life to become a part of the adventures. Yo, top, my boy. Live a little. What's up guys, I'm Osarji. Welcome back to a late night adventure. Today I'm going somewhere that I've been wanting to go to for a very long time. No one's been ever able to show me how to get to this place besides my friend Angelo over here. That's right. So Angelo and I are on a half an hour walk through like, I don't know where we are to be honest here in Canada, but we're going to this place called the Blue Ghost Tunnel. I've been wanting to go here for a very long time. Supposedly it's really haunted. Supposedly there's burial sites right where the tunnel is or in the vicinity. Apparently people died here from a train accident right above the tunnel. That's why they say it's haunted. Also people building the tunnel died inside the tunnel from a collapse. Also another reason why they say it's haunted. Today we're gonna be doing a paranormal investigation inside the tunnel. This tunnel is endless by the way. I don't think anyone has ever gone to the end of it. We will not be doing that today, but we will be going deep inside the tunnel i haven't done a tunnel video in a very long time smash the like button follow me on instagram at mosarji follow me on tiktok at mosarji official the links are down below let's get on with this adventure so just to show you guys we're literally in the middle of nowhere and we've been hearing coyotes everywhere so hopefully they don't come after us we are literally walking we have about a half an hour walk we can't drive through here because of reasons of you know i can't say why but it's gonna be a cool adventure and i'm really hoping we get to find something spooky apparently a blue ghost can be seen throughout this tunnel at certain parts of the night and that is what we're hunting for today is we're hunting ghosts all right you guys we have been walking for quite some time through the forest and this like side abandoned road turn left Oh man, the reason why I'm kind of duck. Yeah, I can see it over there. This kind of reminds me of the Phase Rug Tunnel back in San Diego. Apparently this place is much, much more haunted than that. Whoa, what the hell is this? Oh my God, this is the entrance of the tunnel down there. That's a huge drop off. Whoa, that's scary. So we finally made it to the tunnel. It's how we go inside and investigate. Just basically vlog, and if we capture something on camera, we capture it on camera. We don't really have a plan. We weren't even planning on coming here, but the area of Canada that I'm in right now, Angel's like, yo, we're really close to this place. So let's go and check it out. I'm like, okay, cool, let's do it. We did see someone in the distance in the forest with a flashlight. I don't know who it could be. Whoa, that's creepy. But hopefully it's not someone that's trying to do anything shady. Need y'all to smash that like button, man. If you guys are just coming through here, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We're risking our lives to give you guys content during the lockdown, during the quarantine, and uh, the show must go on. The video drops every second day. What is that noise? I heard something like howling. Yeah, I thought I heard something too. Don't they say like there's like ghost dogs around here too? Yeah. Holy. This is it? Oh my goodness. I've never seen pictures of this place. I've just always been told about it, but never any pictures. Whoa. Dude, this is scary. We're gonna have to get in through there, I guess. Look at that, the door's wide open. That's creepy. All right, you guys, we're about to go in. Thank God I brought my boots. It's not cold out. The door is open, which is cool. Oh, that's creepy. Oh my God. Dude, this is so scary. Yeah, look at all this demonic writing up there. They will follow you home. Okay. Oh man, this place is literally scary. We, I think, I'm not sure, but I heard someone in there. It is very muddy here. As you guys can see. Whoa.
Jesus Christ. I heard voices. I'm not seeing any fresh tracks here, but there definitely will be somebody here. Guaranteed. Could be homeless people. You said people came here one time when you were here and they did a ritual? Yeah, like right around the Missouri, actually. So what did they do exactly? They were trying to summon the devil. They like, brought... Literally, they had old uh, Latin uh, rituals. They were literally seeing it in and, Latin. And when they did that, what happened to your devices? So you told me all the story. Of her, all of her lights started turning off. Uh, one girl who was recording her camera, just like in the middle of recording, just randomly turned off. This Je light was brand new. It turned off. Jesus. Literally like maybe about five seconds ago. So people do come here and do rituals. I don't know why. I don't want to know why. But I would like to see it happen. Also, I would like to see some type of demonic in these tunnels because you know places like this spirits and demons and crazy shit live in these tunnels oh that's creepy you can still see the wax there's candles all on the edges there look at all the wood in the ground here so this tunnel was designed a long time ago to transport stuff underground i don't know why it's kind of shady kind of like a mine shaft look at the water here yeah i should go magnet fishing in this place <laughs> oh wow there's actually stuff in the water. You don't want to fall in that water. There's a lot of metallic items. Do you guys want to see me go magnet fishing here? Let me know in the comments below. Maybe I can make it happen. Look at that. There's candles all on these walls from past rituals, people doing rituals in places like this. You know, it's funny you say that because I was trying to ignore the fact that I kept hearing something behind us and then you mention it. Let's just keep moving. There's definitely no shortage of candles in this place. There must be hundreds of them. They're going all along the walls, all the way down the tunnel. Yep, I've got an upside down cross there, but guys, look at this. There's some, whoa, slippery. There's like these bridge looking things, probably support beams for the tunnel when they built it way back in the day. Whoa. I heard a story about somebody hanging themselves here one time. Yeah, I don't know if it's true, but the beams are, are here. I've heard a lot of stories about this place. So I don't know anyone that's ever gone to the end of this tunnel because it goes for like miles and miles and miles and miles and nobody really knows where it goes. I would like to come back someday and do a video. I feel like, like something's just going to come out of the water any second now. Like some sort of water creature. I don't know. Just my imagination, I guess. I heard something yeah. I almost had like a footstep that like resonated. Yeah, it is creepy, I don't know. It's gotta keep our ears open. I wonder if the K2 meter is getting anything. Anything in here with us right now? What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Yeah. That wasn't my, my voice. It sounded like some something. This is creepy. So Angelo and I are kind of stopped in our tracks right now. We heard a female scream. So we're just gonna see her quietly for like 20 seconds and see if we can capture it on camera again. I feel like I feel like we're being watched. I know. That's how I feel in here. It's, it's weird. Every time I come here, that's exactly what I'm from. Yeah, like everyone will have a different experience when it comes to paranormal. But th this is my experience of how I'm feeling in here. Whether you believe it or not, I really don't care. I'm here to document my experiences in places like this. Damn. Oh, there's a lot of water there. I'm trying to navigate through all this water. Looks like this part of the tunnel is kind of collapsing. I'm just trying to not get wet or my camera wet. There we go, I think we're, we're in the clear. This is very strange. Because when we came in here, we, we heard people talking. It sounded like people were really right here. But past those rocks over there, it's, it's all water. You know what I mean? Like, I don't think we can keep going unless we want to get wet. Jesus. This is all flooded. We can't go any further from here. Unless we plan on getting wet, which I don't plan on getting wet. Have you been past this before? No. Whoa. Dude, it almost looks like those are ghosts, like, on the wall there. That's so creepy. Hello, are there any spirits in here? Whoa. Huh? 
I'm gonna. The hell is that? Wait, wait, what is that? I don't know, I just. I thought I seen something. Do you hear that? Yeah. There's like a bell ringing. My EMF is steady on the other one. Really? Your EMF is going crazy? Look. Mine isn't though. Angel's EMF is spiking, mine is not. Is mine even on? Hold on. I'm gonna turn my light off and see if the EMF starts to blink. Is there anything in here with us? Fuck this shit, turn the light back on. This is too scary. Do you hear that humming? Dude, it's almost out of bed. How is it that your EMF is going off this no time? Idea. Oh, mine's going off too. What the hell? Can't see it from the light. One sec. Mm -hmm. Guys, look at these EMFs. They are going crazy over here. It's like right next to me. Yeah, only beside you. It's almost like there's something near you. Yeah. It's not doing it now. Maybe they're welcoming you back. Yeah, let's back on. Let's back on. <laughs> this is too freaky, to be honest. Okay, so because we cannot move any forward, I, I didn't realize there was going to be this much water here. I thought it was just going to be a little bit where you know our boots would be able to handle it, but it's not going to happen. We're going to come back with waders another day for another video um, and another time. But I do want to take some photos with my night vision camera on my cell phone, the iPhone 11 Pro Max. It takes amazing quality photos in the dark, and it's proven really good to capture things in dark places. So let's go ahead and try that. We're going to turn off all our lights and hopefully we get something. What you got? So look at this, I took like four or five photos in the same place with flash. Look at this weird mist thing. Yeah. And look at the next photo. It's gone. Yeah, that's weird. And then it's gone. And then it's gone. What the hell is that? Whatever we seem to think is following us, maybe? Because that's behind us. Yeah. Oh my god. We did keep saying we felt like we were being followed, right? Yeah. I just took four more photos over there. Behind us? Yeah. Turn the light on. Jesus Christ. What the f was that? I don't know. I think the cameras captured that. What was that? I don't know. I think the cameras captured that. What was that? I don't know. I think the cameras captured that. So guys, I did take a few photos. Um, we're gonna review the rest of them once we get out of here. But we did capture some sort of grunt on camera, very strange. And I captured something on the photos. It looked like some sort of mist figure down that way. You hear somebody talking? Yeah, I hear talking. Like yeah. It literally sounds like somebody's crying. Right? Yeah. Is somebody crying in here? <gasps> oh dear God. Jesus Christ. Oh dear God. Oh dear God. I got it on camera. I got I got a photo of it. With the, with the night vision. Turn off all lights. Turn off all lights. Look at that. What was that? Yeah, I got that on camera. I got that. That's a photo. Oh my god, oh my god. That, that is like an apparition. Yeah, like, oh my god. I took a, a couple photos in the in the dark. Turn your light back on. I'm freaking out right now. <laughs> oh shit, dude. You can see it appearing and then getting bigger. I will put the photo up on the screen so you guys can see. Oh my god, that freaked me out, dude. Dude, what the hell is that? That is a that's a ghost yeah. right there. That is a ghost. Yep, that's a ghost 100 percent it's in two photos too, eh? Yeah, it's in two photos. I'm going to take a, a couple oh. more photos just to verify that it's not something hanging there. So I'm about to review the photos that I just took. I took more than three of each. Nothing from the photos that I took that direction. Dude, what the hell is that? 
Is it showing up again? Look at this. So I took one in that direction where we caught that thing yeah. with a with flash, and look what it caught. This thing moving, right? Mm -hmm. And then I took it in the complete darkness. Yeah. And it's there again. Oh wow. Look at that. I don't know what the hell that is, but that is freaky. It looks more clear in this picture. Mm -hmm. Jesus. It's not like you can see anything with the naked eye. No, there's nothing there. Yeah. Absolutely nothing there. See, look, I just took another photo mm -hmm. with no night vision, and there's absolutely nothing there. It's not there anymore. Gone? Yeah. Wow, as if I caught that on camera. Angel? Yep. Let's back on. Now. What happened? I don't know. I'm taking a photo and I heard something walking over here. Like literally in the water. Really? Yeah. And oh my god, as I heard that, I took a photo out of fear and look yeah. at that. It's there again. Okay, um, yeah, let's get out of here. I, I don't feel safe in here. I feel like I'm being followed. I want to leave. I want to go outside. I want to do some spirit box readings outside. We won't be able to use the spirit box in here because it's going to be too echoey. And I'm kind of freaking out right now, so I want to leave right now. I'm literally trying to just get out of here quickly, guys. I don't feel safe. I'm not trying to risk my life too much. Like, you know, I like to risk my life for videos, but it's so much quieter over here. Yeah. It's not as echoey. It's kind of good. I want to try taking a few more photos here before we leave, mm -hmm. and hopefully those photos will get something. What's up with your camera? Hmm? Your camera looks really weird. My camera? Mm -hmm. What the your focus is just going mental right now. This side. I'm literally recording your screen with my camera right now. Look at it. Yeah, my. Oh my god. Like it, it won't even focus properly. I think there's more than enough light. My camera's focused pretty perfectly fine. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah. It's I'm like not even. I'm not touching the screen or anything. Yeah. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Got something? Oh my god. Oh my god. Dude, I captured three blue ghosts. Really? I'm not joking. Um, okay, so we're, we're gonna, cause you're, you're blinding me with yeah. this. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to put these on camera. Can you see this, Angela? So look at this, right now there's nothing there. Yeah. Okay, right now. There they are. One, two, oh, three. Oh yeah. Blue bells. What the fuck is that? <gasps> Something what? like in the fucking strut? What the fuck is, Yo. oh my god. Dude, that's a fucking person. That's a, that's a person. Where the hell is that? Oh my god, dude. Turn off the lights right now. I can't, I'm holding both cameras. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Look at that. That's Dude, a, that that's, is literally a person. That's that's a person right there. Hanging out in the street. Oh my god. And, there, and there, there, there's all these other ghosts over here. There's something over here blue. And that, was, that wasn't... Face. Look, they were, they're not there before. Yeah. I took... Oh, that's a face! That's a face right there. I can't zoom into it because of my gloves. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, we need to... Hey, let's get out of here. Yeah. Right now. I don't feel safe. Lights. Yeah. We are leaving. Just to show you, this is what I just took a photo of. There's nothing up there. Nothing. nothing up there, nothing here. I captured three blue ghosts standing right here, and then one more up there. Holy shit. Oh my god. Okay, we, we need to leave. I, I, don't, I don't like this at all. You, you guys know me. When I freak out, it's for real. I need to leave. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's very slippery. I can't believe that. I just can't believe that. My first time to the blue ghost tunnel, and it's literally... A blue f ghost. It's just sitting up there, right? The ghost was literally just sitting up there. Holy shit. I don't know. Like, I want to leave because I'm freaking out, but I don't want to leave at the same time. But there's like something that's just keeping you here, right? Yeah. Jesus. What the f is going on here? Yeah, we need to go. Let's go. I know, and there is because I got got it on photo. It'd be nice to get it on video, but it's almost impossible to get an apparition on video. Like, we've had it before, but it's very rare. Photos are the shit though, because photos work in a different way. Oh man, there's two bats there. F that, I don't want a coronavirus, get out of here. Yeah, there's two bats just circling the door. What are the odds of two bats circling the door as we're trying to get out of here? There they are. You see them flying around? Imagine that door is closed or locked. Holy shit, that's a bat. That's a bat right there. Look at it, it's crawling on the wall. Oh my god. Okay, we need to go. Don't worry bats, we're leaving. We're leaving. So now we're back outside of the blue ghost tunnel and 
This was my first time coming in here. I really wish I had some type of clothing where I can go into that deep water. I might have to come back here. Maybe I'll come back here with CJ one day. I want you guys to spam CJ and tell him to come here with me uh, once this quarantine is done and once they open up the borders. Because they ha as of now, they, they haven't opened up the borders. Today is like almost, I think, what, what's the date today? Like May or something like that? It's April 28th right now. That's how lost I am when it comes to the dates because of this whole quarantine. So what we're gonna do right now is use the Necrophonic Spirit Box outside because we're actually getting some activity on the K2 meters out here, which is kind of good. So hopefully we can get something on a Necrophonic. I can't believe these photos. We're gonna actually reevaluate the photos once we get back to safety and we're gonna reevaluate them with you guys. So very excited about that. Yeah, what is that? It's got like a beak of some sort. I took three photos and that red thing was here in the middle. It was right there and it moved. And these photos were in the exact same position. Oh, what is that? Here, let's light up the wall. Maybe we can see what that is on the wall. No, I don't see anything on the wall that resembles that. That's so creepy. Do you see anything on the wall that resembles that? Yeah. <laughs> That's fucking scary. Yo, that bat just flew into this little crevice over here. I'm not sure you guys can see that. There it is. Oh, it's right there. There's the bat right there. It flew and hid into this little crevice. So I'm standing here at the entrance of the tunnel. We haven't left yet. We're still investigating. K2 is going crazy right now, as you guys can see. Well, oh, it stopped now all of a sudden. Any spirits at the entrance of this tunnel? This is how scared we are. We're literally investigating from the entrance. I mean, we did make it in as far as we could. Yeah. And we did spend like a good hour in there just taking photos and just doing whatever, but. The original stories of this place were from the entrance anyways. Yeah, K2 is starting to go crazy. Yeah, oh my cool. God. Oh, what the hell was behind me? What the f was that? Something just walked beside me, dude. I guarantee you guys, and I promise you guys that there's no one else here but us. Oh man, well this is a cool night. <laughs> this is a cool day. All right guys, I got the Necrophonic Spirit Box out right now. Um, apparently most of the people that do come here, they do say they, weird things happen right at the door here. Right? We just got something that said monster. Communist. Are there any ghosts at the entrance of this tunnel? Help. Yeah, I heard that. You heard that? Oh yeah. Was it you that I just took a photo of? How many of you are there? Did you just say I'm dead? That's what I heard. Yeah. I heard phantom as well. Yeah. How many ghosts are in this tunnel, or demons? How many of you are there? Did you die here? Beware. Did you die here? How many of you died here? What's my name? Is that Mo? I don't know. It, it kind, kind of sounded like it. Five. I heard five. There's five of you here? Was that you inside the tunnel that was scaring us, that was walking behind us? Was that you that was on top of the beam? Were you on the beam? I got you on camera. I got you on photo. Are you scared to talk to us? Do you have a name? Mike. Mike? That was instant. Yeah. Your name is Mike. Mike what? Can you make my K2 meter spike? Are there any dead bodies inside the tunnel? Film. It's like something, something yeah. said film. Why do you want us to film? Are you gonna do something? Can you make that door close? Leave. leave. K2 just started spiking and it said leave. Another one that said leave. Is it dangerous for us to be here? Yes. Yes. That was like instant. Why is it dangerous?
Why is it dangerous for us to be here? Help disappear. Are there any demons here? When I said demons, they came you. See that? Yeah. Are there any demons here? Yep, there goes again. Holy shit. And again. So, you can't say that the phone is affecting the K2 because it's not spiking right now. It's only spiking when it's corresponding with answers. We don't, even, we don't even have service anymore. in this area anyway. No, there's no service It doesn't here. matter. Are there any demons here? I'm going to keep asking, are there any demons here? I heard, I heard it say yes. Well, if there's a demon here, I think it's, a, it's scared to talk, communicate to us. I never thought demons were that much of a scaredy cats. You don't scare me. Do you know my name? I don't know if it's like my eyes playing tri tricks on me, but I felt like I've seen that door shake for a second there. Okay, oh. hold up. We're going to end it off. I'm just going to reveal the photos. Wait, wait, hang on. Huh? What's wrong? Your camera turned itself off. How? I don't know. It's not dead. There's still battery. Yeah, what the hell? That's a brand new battery. I literally just noticed yeah, it Yeah, why don't you turn back on? What the f Off? On. See, I told you that kind of stuff happens here. Holy <laughs> I wasn't playing with you, man. No, for real, but my yeah. light works. Weird, right? K2 is just going. Dude, my f camera stopped working. That's a fresh battery. I put it in just before we got in here. We haven't been here that long. And this is why we have two cameras. No, but really. But no. really, like, like, take the battery out, maybe. Yeah. That only happens when there's, like, yeah, that's certain demons around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It won't even turn back on. The battery's not dead. Yeah. If the battery was dead, it would tell me battery low. It wasn't even on red yet. I was I was checking as we were filming. What? I have an extra battery. Let me try that. Keep recording just yeah. in case. Holy crap. <laughs> that's cool. That's awesome. Well, I mean, now I'm going to need a new camera. If it's broken, something might have fried Jesus. my electronics. Okay, here goes nothing. Fr and she's fine? Yeah. How much did you get of that last clip? I mean, I have it anyway, so it yeah. doesn't make a difference, but... That's strange. Yeah. Hold on, I'm gonna try that battery again. Yeah. The old one. This is a fresh battery. I literally put this in. Dude, the juice is completely yeah. depleted. Or, or like, battery. that battery still had juice. I was watching it. It was at, like, halfway yeah, the last too, time I checked. When I, was, when I was taking photos, yeah. it was at half. Yeah, there was still more than enough juice to finish that clip. That was weird. That is very, very interesting. And, and honestly, I, I don't doubt it for a second that it was something demonic that did that because I was teasing whatever it was around mm -hmm. here. Oh my God. Okay, so I'm gonna give you the photos to put in the video on the screen. So when we seen that thing on the beam, mm -hmm. it wasn't there. It materialized. So wow. this first picture, you can't really see it there. Second picture, it looks like it's coming down yeah. onto the beam. The third picture is just sitting there. And yeah, it's, it's literally sitting there. Oh my God. It's literally there on that beam. Holy yeah, like that was a, like you can fully tell that it was a, a body. It wasn't just. I cannot believe I got that on camera. That literally looks like a, a ghost figure just chilling up on the beam watching us. And it's funny because we felt like we were being watched the entire time. What are the odds of that? But what I want to know is what is that other orb thing that we seen behind us in the water areas? I can't explain what that big orb is. So you guys can see what the orb looks like on the screen. Before we got that figure up on the beams, I took photos earlier of that same beam and there's nothing there. Yeah, there's definitely nothing there. And it's literally a blue ghost. Holy moly. All right, guys. Well, that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed this little paranormal adventure. I, I was expecting to go in there much deeper, but I wasn't. I didn't know there was going to be that much water. Angelo didn't know there was going to be that much water either. Although he's been here before, but he neglected to tell me that there's going to be that much water. I because told him he didn't listen. Next time we will bring those like <laughs> full like water suits <laughs> so we don't get wet. Yeah. And That's why I told you to bring your water drone. <laughs> I do want to come here with more than two people though next time because mm -hmm. it's freaking scary. Oh, Even creepy, if it's daytime, yeah, it's super scary in there. Follow me on TikTok at MostRGOfficial and follow 
follow me on Instagram and watch my Instagram stories. If you don't know, a lot of you guys don't know this, but you do follow my Instagram. We just hit 300,000 followers on IG, but a lot of you guys aren't watching the stories. There's a tab where you can watch adventures that I post on my stories on Instagram. So make sure you guys watch those and I am gonna be doing a giveaway at the end of every month from now on, whether it's money or gifts, I'm gonna pick somebody that's watching my stories frequently. So I need to be seeing you guys watching the stories every day for you to win. So I'm gonna be picking random people. Smash the like button, don't forget to be you, do you stay positive and just live a little.